Stitch by stitch, needle through thread, she's determined to get there and will never turn down an opportunity. Which is why Ingrid Urich said yes to making a gala-worthy dress for this year's Heart and Stroke Foundation event. I thought, yes, I'd like to make it, but I always like to challenge myself a little bit more. And so I thought I'd like to make it sustainable. And so out of all um, items that would be reclaimed or recycled or used. And so that's what I did. Known for her 180 style challenge, wearing the same black dress for 180 days to bring awareness to fast fashion while raising funds for a good cause, this Cato instructor is no stranger to upcycling material. The whole idea of wastefulness is very, um, very much in the minds of people, um, especially designers. Um, and, um, and it's also fun. It's a, it's a way of re of challenging your own creativity, right? Because it's not, it's not the same thing to make something look good when it looked like something else. Her outfit worn by Jessica Samuels on the night of the Red Dress Gala is of course made from recycled material. The dress is made from a Christmas tablecloth. Um, I believe the underlay is probably leftover fabric from curtains. Um, the top is made from an a previous dress and uh, the bodice is just found fabric I had at home so I used everything that I could. Sewing for more than 20 years Ingrid is starting her own Facebook page where you can find out more about the dress and her fashions at, at Fashion Sustainable 101. For Castanet News, I'm Jen Zielinski.